Welcome to Freezing Call Edmonton, Alberta here. This unit came in uh, in rough shape. It's pressuring up in the cooling system. We're gonna check to see if it's got combustion gases in the cooling system. We're gonna use this uh, test fluid and try to catch the combustion gases coming out of the cooling system. This is gonna change color if there are gases in the cooling system. You can see it's been pressuring up. If you have a look at the hood there, it's a whole mess. It's all wet from coolant escaping from the pressure cap up there. So we'll give this a shot, we'll see what's in there. This stuff is something you can also do yourself. You can buy this at your local parts store. So when we do this test, we wanna drain out some of the coolant. This thing's already lost enough coolant that the surge tank's already empty or half empty. So we'll get started here. Okay, so let me just grab some safety glasses. There's some haters out there. Okay, so this is just gonna catch whatever gases are coming out of the cooling system. So we're just gonna watch here, this should change color. Sometimes you gotta warm the engine up all the way for the gases to leak out. You shouldn't really be seeing anything to begin with. That is a lot of pressure. This could be the air compressor. It could be a bad head gasket leak. So we're gonna bring this truck into the shop and we're gonna troubleshoot to see if the air compressor is the reason for this. And if it's not, uh, we're gonna dig a little deeper, probably remove the cylinder head and have a look. One thing you can also check is if you just remove your fill cap and have a little look. This should be clean. And so it's covered in white snotty sludge. This is a pretty good indication that it could be a head gasket because you're getting coolant bypassing the head, getting into the combustion cylinder and then making its way around the piston into the uh, crankcase. I'm just gonna check the oil level here. So that's uh, over full for sure. We've got some issues there. Once we get in the shop, we're gonna check to see if we have coolant in the filter as well. You may have a couple of issues. 